Hello everyone, today I will show you how to make plastic yarn out of plastic bags. Of course you will need any plastic bag, I'm just using a regular supermarket bag. And you will need scissors to cut them. Start by stretching and removing all the wrinkles from your plastic bag. And applying a little bit of pressure to remove the air from the inside. Then we proceed to folding it. This is just to make it smaller and easier to cut. You have to pay attention where the bag ends and where the holders start because we want to remove it. We cannot use that part. So remove that part first and you can throw it away, we won't use it. Now move all the way to the end and you're going to remove that part as well. And you can get rid of it, we cannot use it to make the plastic yarn. Now that both ends were removed, we can start cutting and these are the pieces that we're going to save. Just measure how big you want it and start cutting. This will form a loop. If you want them all to have the same size, you can use the one that you previously cut to measure it. But I find that that's not necessary, so from there on I just guess an approximate size and I start cutting it. Now just cut all the way down to your plastic bag. and the last one. You will end up with a lot of little loops. Now start stretching them. Stretch all of them before starting because you will need to use two at a time. And you will pretty much create chains and get them all together. So once you have them all stretched out Just move it a little up and grab two of them. As I said, we're going to kind of create a chain and put it together. So create a loop with the first one, just a small one. And with the second one, you will need another one and you need to pull it through. As you can see, another second loop was created and you will grab the end of your bag and pull it through. Just be gentle, you, you don't want to break it, and just keep pulling little by little until you create a knot. And that's pretty much it. Now you just repeat the process to make the yarn as long as you want or as long as you need. So create a loop from the end of the other one. We're now pull the second back through, you create a second loop. You can stick your head inside and grab the end of the of that loop and pull it through until it's tight and you create a knot. One more time, create a loop with the end of your yarn, grab another piece to attach to it and pull it through the first loop. just enough to create a second loop. You can grab the end or pull your hand through 
and just pull it all the way. And then again move to the end and you continue. You repeat over and over until you have a yarn that's long enough. Put your yarn through it, create a second loop, grab the end, pull it through the second loop created, and pull it all the way until you create the knot. Once you get the hang out of it, it's really quickly and you can see how long it's starting to get. So now we can just start putting it together so it won't get mixed up, it won't get tied, and you just continue like leaving a loop so you can keep creating it. With this you can create things like this. You can use it to crochet, you can use it to knead, or you can use it to wave. And crea create cool projects with it. So I really hope you liked this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more. Thank you for watching.